Hi, students. This is T. Balakrishna, Chemist Lecturer, GPT, Kothagudam. Today our topic is Acids and Bases. Students, the chemical compounds are classified into acids, bases and salts based on their physical and chemical properties. Chemical compounds are mainly classified into acids and bases depending upon their physical and chemical properties. So, today we are discussing about the uh, properties of acids and bases. First, we discuss about the properties of acids. Properties of acids. The first property of acids is acids turns blue litmus to red litmus blue litmus to red litmus blue litmus to red litmus so they convert the blue litmus paper to red litmus paper when we are add the acid to the blue litmus paper the litmus paper is converted into red that is the first property of acid the second property of acids is they so to taste Acids are so to taste. Pulla uh, gauntai. For example, uh, lemon, nimakaya, allowed to the taste pulla gauntai because it contains acid, citric acid. So, uh, uh, lemon is an example for an acid solution. So, it, it uh, what is the taste? Sour. So, it, because it contains citric acid so uh, the example one came out of the acids and nikoda pulla gaunt and other than so they are so to taste third point is uh, acids liberate h2 gas on reaction with uh, metals like sodium potassium and magnesium Acids, active metals in it, 20, uh, sodium, potassium, magnesium, zinc, lanti metals, the reaction of participate is the H2 gas na release chest. Uh, example, uh, for example, we know the general example for acid, hydrochloric acid, HCl. If it is react with magnesium, if it is react with magnesium, it produce magnesium chloride MgCl2 and it produce H2 gas H2 gas so when you are balance the equation here 2 moles of H series react with 1 mole of magnesium metal it produce MgCl2 plus H2 your active metals smarter any metals so H2 gas react here H2 gas will produce yellow only active metals which like sodium potassium magnesium and zinc Land metals so when acids reaction to participate is there, it should produce H2 gas. Okay, right? There is a third point. The fourth point is acids liberate CO2 gas on reaction with carbonates and bicarbonates. Here carbonates means CO3 minus 2 bicarbonates means HCO3 minus so acids are react with carbonates and bicarbonates it produce CO2 gas for example you take bicarbonate Na2CO3 it is a sodium carbonate carbonate CO3 minus 2 if it is react with acids take one example acid HCl it produce NaCl salt plus water Acids are react with base, it produces salt plus water, so CO2 gas. So, when you are balancing the equation, it is 2 moles. Okay, so if the acid is react with carbonates and bicarbonates, it, it produces CO2 gas. Which substance, chemical substance, is produced CO2 gas when it is react with carbonate? That substance is called acid. So, acids are liberate CO2 gas on reaction with carbonates and bicarbonates. 
fifth point acids are good electricity conductors because they have ions for example you take an acid hcl it is split into h plus ions and cl minus ions so this act as a good electricity a good electricity conductor because they have ions they carry the electricity from one place to another place so all the acids have ions so they act as a good electricity conductors next point uh, they react with base to form salt that reaction is called neutralization reaction acids are react with bases so it is in a strong acid it is in a weak base the acid is react with base it produce salt plus water such type of reaction is called neutralization reaction acid is react with base it produce salt plus water such type of reaction is called neutralization reaction so all the acids are ready to participate in neutralization reaction with base these are the properties of acids next properties of bases the first property of bases is bases turns red litmus to blue litmus red litmus paper ni ganaka meeru base ni ganaka add chesthe adi blue litmus paper ga maaripothundi e కెమికల్ అయితే రెడ్ లిట్మస్ పేపర్ని బ్లూ లిట్మస్ పేపర్గా మార్చగలుగుతుందో ఆ కెమికల్ని బేస్ అంటాం సెకండ్ పాయింట్ బేసెస్ ఆర్ బిట్టర్ టు టేస్ట్ బేసెస్ అని కూడా బిట్టర్ అంటే చేదుగా ఉంటాయి బిట్టర్ టు టేస్ట్ నెక్స్ట్ థర్డ్ ప్రాపర్టీ ఆఫ్ బేసెస్ ఈస్ బేసెస్ ఆర్ సోపీ టు టచ్ మనం సోపుని టచ్ చేస్తే ఎటువంటి ఫీలింగ్ అయితే వస్తుందో బేసెస్ని టచ్ చేసినా కూడా అదే 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 ఫీలింగ్ వస్తుంది అంటే సోపుని టచ్ చేసిన ఎలా అయితే జారిపోయినట్టుగా అనిపిస్తుందో అదేవిధంగా బేసెస్ కూడా అలాంటి స్వభావాన్ని కలిగి ఉంటాయి అంటే జాడు స్వభావం కలిగి ఉంటాయి దాన్ని మనం సోపీ టు టచ్ అంటాం బేసెస్ ఆర్ సోపీ టు టచ్ నేచర్ ఆర్ ప్రాపర్టీ నెక్స్ట్ ఫోర్త్ పాయింట్ బేసెస్ ఆర్ ఆల్సో గుడ్ కండక్టర్స్ ఆఫ్ ఎలక్ట్రిసిటీ బేసెస్ కూడా గుడ్ ఎలక్ట్రిసిటీ కండక్టర్స్గా వర్క్ చేస్తాయి ఎందుకంటే బేస్కి సింపుల్ ఎగ్జామ్ మనకు తెలిసింది సోడియం హైడ్రాక్సైడ్ ఇట్ ఇస్ ఫిట్ ఇన్ టు ఎన్ఏ ప్లస్ అండ్ ఓహెచ్ మైనస్ సో ఇక్కడ ఎన్ఏ ప్లస్ ఓహెచ్ మైనస్ ఎలక్ట్రిసిటీని ఒక దగ్గర నుంచి ఒక దగ్గర క్యారీ చేయగలుగుతాయి సో విచ్ హ్యావ్ ఐన్స్ దేర్ యాక్ట్ యాజ్ ఎ గుడ్ ఎలక్ట్రిసిటీ కండక్టర్స్ so acids have ions so act as a good electric conductor bases also have ions for example na is split into ions it produces na plus and oh minus ion so they have ion they act as a good electricity conductor so bases also act as a good electricity conductors fifth point bases react with acids to form salts so here bases are react with acid generally they produce salt plus water so this type of reaction is called neutralization reaction take one example base sodium hydroxide when it is react with acid general acid hcl it produce nacl plus h2o nacl plus h2o it is in a salt it is in a base it is an acid so the base is react with the acid to produce salt this type of reaction is called neutralization reaction neutralization reaction the reaction is called neutralization reaction is it clear these are the properties of base they turns blue litmus to sorry they turns red litmus to blue litmus they are bitter to taste they are soapy to touch they act as a good electricity conductor bases are react with the acid they produce salt are the properties of bases thank you thank you students this is t balakrishna chemistry lecture gpt kottagudam